Yeah, so today I'm gonna show you how I made this uh, demo. This was made in uh, GDevelop. I used uh, iClone 7 to create the animations. Oh yeah, oh yeah, and the backgrounds too. Yeah, so in this video I'm gonna show you how I made this. If you like making your own games, make sure you hit the subscribe button down below. Let's see if we can get 51 likes for this video. Alright, so hit the like button and let's get started. Okay, so we're gonna start with a new project in iClone. Let me find a character. Where's my character? Here's the, um, the fox. I thought it was a dog at first, but it, uh, it's a fox. I believe this was made in a character creator. Yeah, so character creator lets you make your own 3D models. We sell no in 3D modeling, which is great. So I'm gonna go to view and I'm going to set the camera to say left. Uh, let me turn off the shadows. Fix the lighting here, see what looks better. That looks not too bad there. Let's add some animations to our fox. Let's see what we can use. I'm going to try my idle animation. That looks not too bad. See, I'm going to break that animation. All the ways to say frame 500. Let's add the running animation. I'm going to open the uh, motion puppet. And uh, let's see. I'm going to select movement. Let's find running. I'm going to hit preview. And that looks not too bad. I like that. You can change some of these um, settings. Exaggerate it. Make it faster. Do whatever, you, do whatever you want, really. I'm going to record a couple of seconds so I can extract my um, running loop. That should do it. Yeah, close this here. And that animation is going to be from, say, here. Let me put a cap there. I'm going to set the loop uh, somewhere around there. Let me see. Press the right button. I'm going to adjust it until uh, this loops. Let me see. Oh no. I'm getting closer. Maybe it's. Maybe I should zoom in, but I think that looks fine there. I'm going to um, export this. Make sure you're exporting a, a sequence. Okay, and that's a little too big, so let me just make this uh, 180 by um, uh, 120. Actually, <laughs> actually 100 by 120. And uh, yeah, that looks not too bad. So let's export this. Here is the uh, render frames. Let's preview this. Yeah, that looks not too bad there. Uh, let's uh, let's make the background. I'm going to use one of these uh, templates that comes with um, Icon 7. I'm going to try these uh, snow mountains. If you press F on your keyboard, you can uh, center the shot. And you can see that uh, you can extract a lot of backgrounds here. This thing is massive. It's really big. Whoa. You can find all kinds of places in these mountains. Here's the background I made earlier. Here's another one. This is what we're going to use for our game. Uh, maybe we can do a couple of modifications to this uh, map here. Let me put a couple of extra blocks here so, so we know that we have a new map. I forgot to mention that this is a 2020 by 1080. It's a pretty, pretty big map. You can make it bigger, it doesn't really matter. Here is the default uh, platform template. Let me modify this here by simply adding a new sprite. I'm going to, export, I'm going to import my, uh, my sprite. And there is the sprite. Let me uh, position the background. And uh, maybe I can delete these things, I don't need that. Let's drag some of these blocks. Delete that. And uh, yeah, I'm going to make these blocks invisible in a second. Let me just uh, make this bigger. Notice that I'm not creating new objects. Let's see, let's just hide this at the beginning of the level. I'm going to hide all platforms. And here we go. Yeah. And now you have a. Uh, very nice background. Very professional looking for your games. 
Let me show you that demo again. Here it is. And let's play it. There's the fox. Alright guys, uh, you can see that this is uh, extremely simple. There is nothing to it. Yeah, so if you like making your own games, don't forget to hit that subscribe button down below. Uh, let me know what you think down in the comments. And don't forget, we're trying to hit 51 likes for this video. Thanks for watching, and I will see you in the next video. Bye now.